Hi everyone, this is Teacher JB and welcome to the pre-recorded class. Since we are studying the pet study, here are the things that you need to do or to have in order to take care of your pets. So today we're going to learn all about pets and the pet supplies that they will need if you want to have a pet. I told you that uh, having a pet is a responsibility. You are responsible for the whole well-being of the pet. You need to take care of them, you need to feed them, you need to go to the bed to make sure that they are healthy and you need to clean their houses. So now we're going to learn about the pets and the things that they need if you plan to have a pet. So pets. A pet is a type of animal that usually lives with people in a house. People have lots of different animals as pets. We have different kinds of pets that we can choose from. We need special care. Of course, like a family, we treat our pets as family. That's why we need to love them and we need to take care of them. Okay, do you have a pet in your home? Very good. Do you know some animals that can be pets? Very good. We can uh, have a pet dog, a cat. Uh, we can have a pet fish. We can also have a pet bird. But there are lots of pets that we are going to learn today. First one is dogs. There are lots of different types of dogs in the world. They range from very small like a chihuahua to very big like a great bean. So there are different kinds of dogs that we can have. There are big dogs and small dogs. There are hairy dogs and short hair dogs. Dogs takes a lot of time and patience to train and look after. They need lots of walks and exercises and lots of toys to keep them from getting bored. Most dogs are very friendly and like to be around people. That's why we call dogs the man's best friend. Okay, do you want to have a pet dog? If you do, here are the pet supplies that uh, the dog is going to need. These are the things that dogs need if you plan to have a pet. The first one is a collar leash. You need to have a collar for your dog. We have a crate or carrier, food and water bowls. Uh, you need to have dog shampoos if you plan to bathe your dog dog food, toothbrush, and toothpaste because some dogs have a bad breath so you need to brush their food. Okay. You need to have ID tags so that the dogs will not get lost. We have dog beds for the dogs to rest. Brush and nail clippers okay, for grooming. You need to also provide dog toys so that the dogs will not get bored. Dog treats and also pods and Book bags. You need to have those for the groomings of the dogs. Next, cats. The cats are usually quiet pets. They love to play with toys and cats like to be stroked, but you need to be gentle with them. Okay, cats like to have lots of space, so some people let their cats out of their house to go outside on their own. There are indoor cats and outdoor cats. We have cats who loves to stay inside the house, and there are also cats who loves to wander outside our house. Cats mostly eat dry or wet food, which is made of meat, the cat food. Okay, do you want to have a, a pet cat? If you do, here are the things that your cat needs. So these are the necessary things that your cat needs. Of course, you need to have a cat carrier, cat food, uh, food and water bowls. You need to have a litter box for their poops, a cat toy so that the cats will not get bored inside the house. You have to have a scratching post for the cats and the grooming kits or grooming supplies and first aid kits. Okay, these are only recommended for your. Uh, these are the things that is only recommended for your cat's entertainment. So you need, uh, you can have a cat tree okay, in your house if you want to, but you need to put an ID tag or collar to your cats. You need to have a flea or tick medication, okay, pet cleaning supplies, and cat bed, okay. Um, um, these materials are only optional, okay? 
uh, water fountain. But if you have a water bowl, you don't need a water fountain anymore. Cat treats if you are cleaning your cat. And catnips. Guinea pigs. Guinea pigs are small animals. They are similar to hamsters, mice, and rats. Okay, guinea pigs can get scared around loud noises, so you need to be quiet and gentle with them. Guinea pigs usually live in a hutch outside. They need straw or hay to eat and also to sleep in. They sleep in the hay and they also eat those hays. They also like to eat fruits and vegetables such as peppers and spinach. Okay, do you want to have a, a pet guinea pig? If you do, here are the things that you are going to need for your pet. Okay, things that the guinea pigs need. Okay, first you need to have a fleece liner bedding, a chloroplast box okay, for the house, you need to have a ceramic bowl for the food, and the, uh, you can also have a water, bo a water bottle for the uh, water of the, your guinea pig. You need to have a cage for them because they might get lost in the house. Okay, food and tunnel to play. They like to play inside the tunnel. A limited amount of hay because as I said earlier, they, they sleep and they eat the hay. Okay, and also a hidey house okay, if they want to play hide in their uh, cage. Next are rabbits. Okay, rabbits are very pop popular pets. Many rabbits like to be stroked and some will not let you pick them up. So they like being with other rabbits so it's best to keep two rabbits together in the same pot. So if you have one rabbit, you need to uh, get another rabbit because the one rabbit that you have might get sad and bored in their hutch. They need lots of space to hop around and stretch out. Some people let their rabbits out in the garden. Rabbits like lots of fresh vegetables to eat such as cabbage and broccoli. So rabbits don't just eat carrots. Uh, yes, they love carrots, but they eat also their uh, other vegetables like a cabbage and broccoli. Do you want to have a pet rabbit? Very good! If you do, here are the pet supplies that you are going to need for your pet rabbit. Okay, these are the things that the rabbit needs. Okay, you need to have a water bowls and food bowls for them. You need to have a mat for them to stay in, like the ones in the guinea pig. Recycled paper litters. You need to have a little litter box for them if they ever if ever they are dirty. Okay, you need to have hay feeder. Okay, you, uh, because in the hay uh, they sleep on it and it's their resting place and also sometimes they eat hay. Okay. And mats for them to sit in. And also if you want to add, you can also have uh, some place for them to play. You can have small toys for them or a wheel so they can run into. Okay, hamsters. Hamsters are very small animals. They are usually kept in a cage with sawdust and hay for their bed. Some hamster cages have tunnels and wheels for the hamster to run around. This helps to stop them from getting bored, okay? They love to have wheels to run around. That is their form of exercise. Hamsters like to eat seeds, cereals, and fresh fruits such as veg uh, apples. Okay? They often keep their food in pouches in their cheeks so they can move it from place to place. Okay, they put their food in their cheeks like this. And then they're going to move around their place and eat this and eat the food just around the house. Do you want to have a pet hamster? If you do, here are the pet supplies that we are going to need. So these are the essential hamster supplies. First one is a cage because uh, we know that hamsters are very small. You cannot just leave them outside because your cat may eat them or they might get lost inside the house. And next you have to have a bedding or nesting materials. That is the hay because the hamster sleeps in the hay. Next is the exercise wheel. It's for the hamster's entertainment and of course a form of their exercise. And then you need to also have a hamster food bowl 
for their foods and a water bottle to drink. Okay. Since hamsters are like guinea pigs, they need to also have a hide box for them to rest. Next are horses. Okay. Horses need lots of special care. They are big animals so they need lots of space to rest and to run around. Horses are usually kept in special homes outside cold stables. So the house of the horses are cold stables. Horses need to be groomed regularly and checked to make sure that they are healthy, especially their hooves. Horses eat mostly grass and hay. They can also eat some fruits and vegetables as snacks, such as apples and carrots. But their favorite food are grasses and hay. Do you want to have a pet horse? Okay, if you do, here are the things that you will need for your pet horse. Okay, first one is a body brush. So we said earlier that we need a lot of grooming for our pet horses. So you need to have a body brush, a curry combs, cactus cloth grooming neat, a dandy brush, hook pick, hook oil and brush, mane and tail combs, massage pads for the horse because they like to run around, right? So you need to massage their body, sponges for cleaning, sweat, uh, sweat scraper, and water brushes. Since we said earlier that first horses, uh, your uh, most responsibility for your uh, pet horse is about grooming. In their houses, you will only need their hays and their food bowls so that they can eat and it should be a lot of space so that the horse can rest and sleep in the stable. Fishes. And fishes are very popular pets. They are good for people who don't have enough space at home to have bigger pets such as dogs and cats and horses. Okay? Fish needs to be kept in a tank called an aquarium. So the house of the fish is called an aquarium. The tank needs to be cleaned often so that the water stays fresh and the fish stay healthy. Okay, you need to clean the water every single time because if the water is dirty, your fish might get sick. Some fish, such as tropical fish, need special heater in their tank to keep the water warm. So you need to also set the temperature of the water for your fish. They may also need salt water rather than fresh water. Fish eat special plates or pellets that you can buy from pet shops. So they eat of, of flakes and pellets. Do you want to have a pet as they were? Uh, do you want to have a pet fish? If you do, here are the things that you are going to need. Okay, first is an aquarium. Okay, the aquarium where you will place your fish. And you need to also put a live rock or rocks in there so that the fishes will have a place to sleep in or to hide. You can also put their grasses. Okay, uh, seaweeds or uh, uh, water plants so that the fish can rest in them because that is their bed. Okay, sea salt mix the food. Uh, filter equipment okay, to, clean, uh, to help clean the water in your aquarium. You need to have air pumps and also lighting okay, so that you can see your pets even at night. And test kits for your pets. Next one is birds. There are lots of different birds that can be kept as pets, such as parrots and cockatiels. Some birds can be kept outside in a big cage called an aviary. Other birds need to be kept indoors, but they still need plenty of space. Indoor birds need a large, large cage and space to fly around to stretch their wings. So don't have a very small cage because the birds cannot fly. You need to provide a large space cage so that the birds can practice flying inside the cage. Birds such as parrots can eat special bird food that you can buy, but they also like sand fruits. There are bird feeds that you can buy, but they, all, but they also eat fruits and seeds. 
Do you want to have a pet bird? If you do, here are the pet supplies that we are going to need. So, these are the things that the birds need. First is a habitat or the cage. You need to buy a cage for your pet. You cannot uh, have a pet just outside because it might fly out of your house. Next is stand for their swing. They need to have branches inside their cage so that they can rest on them. Perches and food. Okay, you need to have food for them. They eat pellets, seeds, or fruits. And also you need to provide toys for them like swings and other toys so that they can play around inside a cage and treats you need to give them. So since we uh, studied about the pets that we usually have at home, here are the uh, unusual pets that some people have, okay? Some people have pets that are more unusual. This includes giant African land snails, snakes, spiders, tarantulas, and tortoise. These animals need lots of special care to keep them happy and healthy. These are the unusual pets that some people have. Okay, some people have snails as their pets. Some people have snakes as their pets. Okay, a tarantula and tortoise or, or other kinds of turtles. Do you want to have these kinds of pets? Okay, but you need to be responsible enough to take care of them. is all for today. I hope you learned a lot about the things that your pet needs, the pet supplies that they will need if you plan to have a pet. And if you already have that kind of pet and we discussed it uh, before, okay, now you know the things that they are going to need. Bye everyone! I'll see you next time. I hope you learned a lot!